Strongest smell of the sulfur in the Reckonus Peninsula of Iceland is burning the throat of the people. That's quite dangerous in a way because it makes the breathing difficult, especially for people with asthma. All over the region now we have this smell. Uh, originally people thought that is because of the volcanism. There is no volcanic eruption at the moment. Old lava doesn't uh, emit much of these uh, uh, fumaroles. But industrial complexes like the geothermal power plant release the hydrogen sulfide in large quantities to the environment. That may affect also uh, the quality of the air that we are breathing. Uh, sulfur dioxide is another source. They can be both from the volcanic uh, eruption sites, but again, uh, cold lava doesn't have, uh, or even the semi-hot lava doesn't have much. We can have it in the form, for example, this is Fagodestio. We had it, but it just... Uh, uh, just a nearby area, but the most uh, uh, evident culprit is the geothermal power plant and also the volcanism in the Alaska and the Kamchatka Peninsula in Russia and the United States of America, also in the Gulf of Mexico where we have there a lot of uh, you know volcano Popocatépetl is active, also in the Gulf of Mexico in Texas, those areas we have also, and industrial activity in the Europe also can lead to that especially around the Mediterranean areas, and it comes all to Iceland, ends up there in the uh, higher, uh, higher latitudes.